This one's for you, Bob. This one's for you, Bob. Sometimes, sometimes I. (laughs) (laughs) Fuck out of here, dude. to get these videos out to you every Tuesday so I have to come to the shop and grab some pressure washing hose I'm cleaning my house and my gutters and all that stuff that's usually what I do every year on Memorial Day is clean my own windows do my own pressure washing but uh, yeah this is about the handy sleeve this video I'm not sure how much you can show b-roll wise on cleaning windows when it comes to a scrubber sleeve now this is the original handy sleeve which they're still gonna make these this is an 18 inch it's got the button snaps go right on your t-bar that one's always a pain in the ass but it's on a little tight right there at least on this t-bar I'm using this is the Ergotech Ninja t-bar 18 inch I got a hedgehog here for because I like the the way this has changed the new version which this is a review of that you can kind of see how big 
that is on there which is okay I mean it still works it worked for me no issues um, I've been using the handy sleeve for a very long time um, I don't know where my other t-bar is at ah shit my other t-bar is on my front porch but it has one of these on it this is the original handy sleeve right here I got sent a couple of these I was given two um, to uh, for testing in I think the winter of 2018 I'm fairly certain um, I still have that original one still on my t-bar but this is one of the original ones Richie made himself um, along with this an original pad that he made um, I keep stuff like that you know, I don't know why I do it but that's just the type of person I am I just keep things like that if I have an extra and it doesn't take a crap on me the, the original version of it I'll keep my second set like my you know if I have two I had at one time two gunslingers but there was a lot of things that tip jars whatever you want to call them um, I had an a spare I ended up I gave that to Tim uh, from Outlaw Window Cleaner. I gave it to him. He didn't have one, so I gave it to him. But uh, most, for the most part, I keep a hold of everything. But and this Maker Python sleeve. You guys seen the porcupine? There's the. I don't know what this one is. I'm not too big of a fan. I wish this part of this was here instead of there. I wish it was here. Like this all fuzz, and then that part Velcro. That's just the way I would have done it. But you know, whatever. Um, of course the porcupine and again my Scotsman's at the house here I got a dirty one here here's a dirty one and the Scotsman um, this is actually an original Scotsman all my Scotsman's are prototypes all of them made by Richie I kinda when I review something especially for Richie because Richie and I are pretty good friends everyone knows that um, I tend to use things as long as I possibly can before um, they break down. That's that's the whole goal in testing. Um, I, you know, I'm not saying. I just that way people have complaints about stuff like, oh man. You know this breaks that breaks you know I at least have a bearing on what they're saying like you know that's possible and then other guys are just looking for something for free which is a lot of dudes and I'm not saying that anyone that uses any of these is never gonna have a problem I'm just saying this stuff's pretty durable I'm not the busiest clean window cleaner in the world but I clean windows six days a week 365 days a year but anyways maybe take one week off for vacation and a day off for every holiday like today but this is the new handy sleeve and this is a little slimmer and notice no snaps so what you do is you slide this on here. first you stop it from sticking to everything I don't know if you guys seen the podcast but Casper made mention that this is the highest quality hook and loop material you, you can get no expenses spared on this but it just kind of folds over on itself because the back side is velour just folds over on itself and look how tight that is on the t-bar it's super tight very low profile compared to the old version which they're still selling if you prefer the snaps which I can understand and then here it is on the new sleeve see how much tighter that is makes the porcupine of the profile a little a little bit smaller so it's easier to get in and out of your your bucket on a belt not just the silencer any bucket on a belt you're just trying to make the profile smaller so every it's more of a universal tool that's another reason why they made the changes to the handy sleeve that they made this time is so you can use it not just on their t-bar but any t-bar um, I don't know if it's gonna work on a backflip but rumor has it it might so but yeah man if you want quality window cleaning gear um, you know, I know some of the maker products, like especially like the Silencer and the Grackle, are a little on the pricey side. But if you're wanting to have a durable tool that's going to last a long time, the handy sleeve system, you really can't, you can't go wrong with it. 
the ends will never wear out on your T-bar again. Your mop's not going to slide off and be hanging down here dangling. You know, just good, it's good stuff. And this new imp this improvement, I like. I've had no issues with it so far. None. None. I love it. So I wish I had my other T-bar here. That's such a bummer. I don't know. It's a bummer. I wish I would have brought that. I wish I would have brought that because I know I'm not going to shoot the rest of this video. About midnight tonight, I'm going to be editing this and being like, shit, I should have shot that. But I know I'm not going to remember. I'm going to try. But yeah, you can go to www.maker.com buy yourself some handy sleeves. Uh, their Trident belt is amazing. Of course, everyone knows I love the silencer. And there's going to be some new stuff coming soon. If you missed the podcast, you should go back and watch it. I'll link it at the back of this video. But you should go watch it. Um, it's nice talking to Richie and Casper. And it's exciting to know that there's some cool stuff coming. That they've got a lot of that stuff. You know, with the, the pandemic and... Um, you know, manufacturing getting messed up and shipping and everything. Now that everything is back on track, um, just knowing that there's going to be some cool stuff headed your way, I'm super excited because a lot of the stuff I've known about for a couple years now, and I'm like, man, I can't wait for that stuff to come out. You guys are going to be really hype on a lot of this stuff that's coming out. So, but I appreciate you guys. Please like, comment, subscribe. Anything that I put in this video is not a reflection of Maker or my favorite supplier, windowcleaner.com. There's going to be an affiliate link in the description below. Uh, click that before you go shopping. I get a little kickback. It really helps this channel. It helps me buy the equipment to do these videos because I'll be honest with you. Um, I still have the original brass squeegee I started with when I first started window cleaning. The first window cleaning tool I ever purchased is still in my toolbox. I still use it. So, you know, doing these tool reviews and stuff, I do this for you guys so you guys can make a decision on whether or not you want to buy something. Is this worth buying? You know what I mean? And if you value my opinion, which a lot of people don't, I'm sure that'll make this video. Um, <laughs> in fact, I'm going to make sure I find that. I went on a little bit of a rant, but some people I tell you um but yeah if you if you value my opinion you know I would appreciate it before you go shopping at windowcleaner.com if that's where you shop because that's where I shop um just click that link that link that very first link will take you through to the windowcleaner.com store you fill your card up you check out I get a little bit of I get I get some shekels you know a few ducats it's not anything extravagant that's why I'm talking about it in every single video so <laughs> Contrary to belief, I'm not on the payroll. But, uh, yeah, man. I really appreciate you guys watching. Handy sleeves, man. You're, you're dope. A handy sleeve, man. The new and improved version. Excellent. Excellent, yeah. Yeah, let me pull it off here. Oh, it's all wet. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. But yeah, you just see the profile so much smaller with this new one. My God, TJ. Handy sleeves. Snaps. No snaps. Get you some of that. This, this, this right here. No more of this. No more of that. No more of that. No more of that. No more of that. That eliminates, the, the, this system eliminates that. No more wiener poking through on your bun there. You know what I mean? It's bun length. But, uh, yeah, none of this twisty when you're on the glass, making no pressure, not scrubbing good. The handy sleeve eliminates that and this. And this right here prevents that.